Please subscribe to this channel and also tap the notification bell in order for you not to miss out on any of our videos. The Secretary General of the Presidency of the Republic, Ferdinand Congo, has not yet given up his apron in the succession race. According to his first detractor, Boris Betold, he would have submitted proposals to Paul Bia to replace Mbaga Nguele in the police and Joseph Beti Asomo in the Ministry of Defense in the next government. According to the revelations of Boris Betold, a cabinet reshuffle is imminent. At least far from the usual speculations, Paul Bia seems to have clearly sent the first signals on Friday, January 12, 2023, in the decree appointing the members of the Board of Directors of the National Institute of Statistics, INS, where it is announced the creation of a Ministry of Population Policy. What this refers to, we will know more. However, it is now clear that the government is preparing. It is therefore in the wake of this government's preparation that several consultations were held. Paul Bia, therefore, a few weeks ago, as usual, asked his Secretary General of the Presidency of the Republic, Ferdinand Gongo, the punk man, to make his proposals for a government. Very happy, yet it is not the first time in recent months that Paul Bia has asked him for a government. He decides to replace men. Thus, in the next reshuffle, for example, it is expected that the current Delegate General for National Security, Martin Mbaga Nguele, will be replaced. He is tired and even asking for an ambassador's post in order for him to go get treatment. He has been asking to leave for months, but Paul Bia said nothing. In place of Mbaga Nguele, Ferdinand Gongo proposes Dominic Baya, the current Secretary General of the Police a man whom Mbaga Nguele considers to be very corrupt and without personality. His name also came up again recently in several cases of influence peddling, where he did not hesitate to use his little brother, the Deputy Director of Economic Investigations at the Judicial Police, Commissioner in Gimbu. The Divisional Commissioner, Dominique Bayer, very close to the clan of the punk man, is the former head of the National Office of Interpol, where he had not left a good image. In the post of Minister of Defense, there is currently Joseph Beti Asomo, who may not leave the government, but will be assigned to another post. Although ill, it is an open secret at the palace, Beti Asomo is held in high esteem by Paul Bia. To replace Joseph Beti Asomo, Ferdinand Gongo proposed to Paul Bia Galax Etoga, the current Secretary of State for Defense. The punk man and Galax Etoga are both graduates of the Institute of International Relations, IRIC, as is Ferdinand Gongo. Moreover, they will be colleagues at the Ministry of External Relations, MINREX, between August 2010 and December 2011, when the current Secretary General of the Presidency held the post of the Secretary General. When Ferdinand Gongo was appointed the Secretary General in December 2011, a few months later he brought his foal to his side. Galax Etoga initially has no official function. He is assigned to write security notes and sometimes take care of his boss's private tasks. Galax Etoga will rise through the ranks to the point of becoming his private secretary. On March 2, 2018, when on the proposal of the Secretary General of the Presidency of the Republic, Paul B. appointed Galax Etoga head of the Gendarmerie. There is no doubt that Ferdinand Gongo's proposal clearly aims to finalize his control over the entire security and defense apparatus with a view of preparing the battle for the succession.